Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Toast and today we are back with another Final Fantasy Brave Exodus video and today we're gonna take on the Desert Despair. Here's the party, so Camille is gonna be there. She's making a comeback with Eileen and uh, they're gonna be my chainers. We're gonna have Aiko to basically build up that Esper gauge. Siege Art! 100% evade tank or 95% something like that and Folka is basically just there to cast some uh, status immunity and all of this good stuff so this fight actually uh, really really easy as I keep looking to my left a uh, really easy fight basically uh, the hardest thing to do is just making sure that you're able to kill him with a limit burst so you don't overkill him too fast and uh, so if you have a hundred percent evade tank or just a physical cover tank with a lot of uh, defense and spirit you're gonna be good but just here we're gonna go for a stylish form Folka, like I said before uh, she's just here to do like these things right here so we're gonna make sure that our party is not gonna get any uh, status elements because I think he can stop us uh, is there a stop yes paralyze and stop so we want to make sure that this doesn't happen so uh, you don't need a buffer on turn one what I'll do is uh, I'll probably not boost my fire resistance right now. We're gonna go Earth Shattering Blade. I did not awaken them because basically it would be maybe a waste of uh, power crisps. So we're not gonna do this. So let's chain. Wait, wait. Before we chain, let's get some LB gauge fill rate and also build up that Evo. Let's put a little bit more volume in here and uh, let's chain those two girls together. That was not a perfect chain, unfortunately. But we're going to be able to do some damage. Obviously, on the next turn, uh, what I'll be able to do with Siege Art is basically do a full break. Uh, where I'm going to be able to break all the stats. So you can basically break attack, magic, defense, and spirit. And uh, Eileen is dead. That's weird, because before when I did this, that did not happen. But it doesn't matter. Since we have Folka, we're going to be able to cast a nice dual white magic. And basically get a full life on her. And let's go for a nice big heal. Just like that. Bam. And we're back in business. So right here. Uh, like I said, I'm going to do a full break charm. So we're going to break the attack and magic and defense and spirit. With Camille. Uh, we're going to boost our fire resistance. Because the boss does fire damage. And with Ico, You know what? We're just going to cast this right here. And we're going to be able to cast our first Esper on the next turn. So let's see if that fire resistance up helped. Yep, there you go. So second turn, just cast fire resistance. You're going to be good. Uh, obviously, you guys can bring other characters that do a lot more damage. Uh, I just basically wanted to bring Eileen and uh, Camille back because, you know, these two girls, they go way back. And uh, I find that uh, Eileen is not getting enough love out there. So, yeah, that's the one thing. So let's go with this. We're going to go with... Let's uh, forget about Bahamut right here for a second. Let's get that chain going, see how much damage we can do. Not bad, 66%. Uh, that was a misclick. Well, that was a misclick. What's, uh, what's happening? Alright, wait, wait. Okay. That was a big misclick. Okay. So uh, my app decided to go a little bit crazy. So we're going to cast damage reduction with Siege Heart. And on the next turn... We're going to go back to the AoE cover, and on turn 5, basically, we're going to go back to uh, a full break. So that's one thing we're going to have to do. Let me check something fast, fast. I want to know why my app was going crazy. Uh... If I put it like that. Alright, let's see if this works better. Sorry about that. So, I want to basically cast some Esper's. We're going to go here. Boom. We have another Esper on the way. Uh, our HP is actually looking really, really good. So we're just going to cast Flowing Waters one more time. The boss is basically still broken. Uh, I'm going to have to cast maybe a uh, MP heal after. But for now, we're still looking good. So let's just get these two girls going. And we're still not getting a perfect chain. And hopefully we're going to be able to kill the boss with a limit burst. Because, you know, you do want those two tickets. So everything was completed already. It's not that hard of a fight, trust me. Obviously if you have a 100% evade tank, uh, it's a little bit easier. 
since mine is only 95% because uh, I'm too lazy to put out 100% I like to live on the edge that's the trick I love to live on the edge so uh, on this turn we're gonna cast our full break charm if uh, Siege Heart decides to stop countering which is really good because he counters for days keep going my man keep going just heal back up great uh, all right that just happened so my app all right so my app decided to do a little bit more stuff okay that's uh, not nice not nice at all all right so we're gonna go for the MP heal well that was funny let's go like this siege heart you're gonna go back to your full break charm uh, that was a wasted turn but it doesn't matter wasted turn or not we're gonna keep going we're gonna do this basically get this right here and uh, you know what just for fun let's cast a little bit more stuff so how was your day guys how was your week how's the boss what did you guys use as a team to beat this boss uh, obviously like I said before you guys can use pretty much anything this boss is really not that hard all you have to do is just basically uh, use the right characters put some machine killers on your units and you're gonna be able to deal a lot of damage because basically he doesn't have that much HP he has uh, 10 million HP he has no resistance to anything you can break him uh, so he's not that hard of a boss and he does a little bit of fire damage but the rest all physical attacks so they're really easy to deal with uh, I want to check one thing so this is good Times. Uh... I'm gonna switch this because I want to make sure my thing works because I don't want my game to go crazy again and basically waste a turn but uh, right now Siege Art is doing the work he's doing the work so let's go here again let's get those chaining pile driver moves going and let's see if this works out good yep there you go still no perfect chain but we're still doing a lot of damage now the trick is basically bring him down as low as possible and after that uh, basically use siege arts limit burst to maybe kill it at the end and do a little bit of extra damage with Icor here and there and Folka you know what there's nothing to do with you so let's just cast some re-rays just in case on our uh, our beautiful physical attackers right here and uh, siege arts we're gonna go wait let me see can can I click on you? There you go. Alright, so this is so great. The fact that you're able to see how many turns are left for everything. So we're going to go for uh, Stylish Form again. We're going to get this thing back up. Just in case the boss is still broken. So we're going to be good. Nice and easy. Evade all the attacks. Still no damage. A little bit of damage here and there. But for the rest, really, really easy. Camille... And Eileen, I commend you to do a lot of damage now. Obviously, if you guys bring a buffer, things could be a little bit easier. Uh, since you're going to be able to deal a little bit more extra damage. But for the rest, like I said, if you just keep uh, his physical attacks 100% evade. And uh, basically keep your fire resistance up. It's not that big of a deal. And obviously, this guy is just countering for hours. So, let's see if we can finish the job right here. Let's go, bam, and let's go, bam. Obviously, if we had perfect chaining, I think we'd do a little bit more damage, but can he finish the job? No, he can't. All right, thank you, Siege Art, for not finishing the job. Basically, on the next turn, we're going to be able to finish everything. Uh, and just in case, we're just going to go for this one more time, because on the next turn, the boss is going to be dead with Camille and Eileen using their beautiful beautiful limit burst so guys are you excited next week do you think it's going to be Axstar, or you guys still think it's going to be an old banner uh if so please let me know down below i know it's a lot of questions today but hey if Axstar is coming out next week it's going to be great are you going to be summoning obviously i am because the man is going to be the man's a legend the man's a legend he's able to chain with mirror of equity He's able to chain with uh, Divine Ruination, imbues the element on his attacks. Uh, he, de he deals a lot of damage, guys. So if you keep your Lapis for him, 
that's gonna be a good good choice and also how did you beat this boss i want to know the team that you use how many turns did it took you i think it would have been a little bit faster because this video is getting a little bit longer uh basically just because siege art decides to counter everything and i wasted a turn with these two girls right here but for now let's finish the job let's kill this boss right here get these girls going their limit burst ba bam ba bam camille's limit burst is actually really really cool so is eileen but i wanted to show a little bit of love to eileen and camille especially because she got her ability awakenings and uh, Eileen, we don't see enough of her, so Gumi, please do something about her. It would be really nice if you guys can make her uh, maybe a true double end unit or a dual wield unit. Because right now, she's stuck in between both. Uh, so, uh, I don't know, give her a dual cast ability, something that would make her a little bit better. But, we got everything. Easy fight, like I said, just break the attack defense magic and spirit keep the fire resistance up which i did not do throughout the whole video but it doesn't matter because our team had a lot of hp and uh, spirit and defense and you deal as much damage as you want guys thank you so much for watching this video please leave a like down below subscribe for more and i'll catch you guys on the next one peace